Okay, quick video to show you this new product we've got in. Um, it's a bit different to our normal products, but we liked it, so we thought we'd buy it. Um, so what you got is a little bit driver for using in a cordless drill. And if I hold it against the black, the back background, what you've got is a combined drill and tap. So it will drill your hole and tap a hole for you all in one go, which makes it easier and quicker. Obviously, I think they won't last as long as drills and taps um, but they do save your time um, right so we're gonna have a go we're gonna try and do that in a bit of metal here we've got a bit of steel you can see we've created these um, these threaded holes here and I'm just using this tool this steel this is pretty tough steel I think they'll work better in aluminium obviously work quicker but this steel is if I zero that he's three point three and a half mil thick or so, so it's a reasonable bit of steel. Right, Ian did the first one, I haven't used these before, do you reckon it's worth using the bit order or just put the bit straight in the... Uh, if you want to do different sizes, that one is quick release, oh, yeah, so you can just pop it in and out, yeah. or you can just use them straight in the drill, either or. Right, and how's it labelled on here, which is M6? They're labelled on the bits. On the bits themselves, it'd be handy if they did it on the thing, wouldn't it? Right, and so if we look on there... What have we got written on there? M6 by... Oh, I got it upside down, yeah. There you next go. Next one, next one. No, no way. There we go, M6 by 1. There you go. Just about, says it. Yeah. So yeah, you can see which one it is. It would be better if they'd have marked it on there. But let me see if I can remember what they are. So it starts off with M3, oh. M4, M5, M6, and then it jumps in twos. M8 and M10. Obviously the M10 you're going to have to do it in thinner material is, is, or softer material. I think you're going to be pushing your luck. Uh, but let's see how this Should goes. Just clip in. Pull that back. Okay, there we go. Let's have a look. Yep, so that's that's in there right. tight. Right, let me do it. Let's have a look. Where have you got it gripped? Oh, you can. Hey, you can do it. Here we go. Right then. So... If we'd have sent a punch, it would have been better. Now, one thing to know, and I did mention in the write-up, was using some cutting oil would actually give you more life out of them. It's not going to make it any quicker, necessarily. Piloting would obviously help as well. And there we go, there's an M6 hole. So we've got an M6 bolt here. Hmm. Let me screw this one in. Yeah. <laughs> right then. So, there we go, so we've created ourselves a threaded hole there pretty quick. 